mini Briar Barn tour, so let's get started. So, little, uh, the wood Briar Barns take up too much space, so I used a shelf that I found in my basement. I duct taped it, I put carpet samples down, and I made it my barn. And I also used, like, a piece of wood for a turnout field. So, yeah, let's get started. So, on the bottom level, I'll start, because that's where my horses, live, horse are, horses are. Like, see their fabric samples. And the first horse is Cowboy. Each horse here has their ribbon. The Cowboy has two hays. Each horse has two salt licks, a grain bucket, and then a water bucket on their fence. So, yeah, and each horse is wearing a blanket and a homemade halter. Oops, that ribbon just fell, but whatever. The next horse is Muffin. The cowboy is a racer and a jumper. Muffin is a, like, retired horse. She does, like, some western and trails. And she has a, each horse has their own halter. And then horses have, like, show halters, too. Besides first spot, he has a different type. This is Delilah and her full spot. And spot has this... One, it, it's like a built-in halter with a chain and a lead. And, yeah. Here is Daisy. And, yeah. And there is Romanza. She has, like, a homemade stall. Because, oh, I also made, like, that fence. That's for Daisy. Because she, like, she's spoiled. She has four ribbons. The mailbox is near her. In her stall, her water bucket's like over in the corner, and she also has her own hay bale or hay bag. And there's also one in the trailer. Okay, and then there's like a platform with three cones on it to warn you that there's a ladder there. And you go up the ladder, and you're on the tack level. So the horses magically jump up. Um, up there, this is like the saddles and stuff, and not all the bridles, because some are in tack trunks of people. There's a thing that someone won at a show. There is a saddle, like a larger saddle, a western saddle. And then here there is a show saddle pad, a saddle, a racing saddle pad, and a saddle under there. And there's two fluffy show pads right here. Oh, that just fell off. Um, under here there is one saddle with stirrups and one without. That saddle pad goes on that saddle, and under it there is a lighter one. And then back there is Spot's tack. Um, I'll go to the tack trunks first. These two girls, Annabelle and Tessa, they, like, parents own. They were just at a show, and Annabelle's horse, like, she fell off, so she got a smaller trophy. So in front of their two trunks, there is one riding crop and then another right there so we'll start with Tessa's just bring it down here so I can show you well first she has her horse cowboy's bridle on the top it's just a white racing bridle well not really like it can be used for jumping but it's mostly racing then a bed of flowers that cowboy won and inside there is Cowboys, and these are both Cowboy and Romanza's Martingales. The white one is a show, and the blue one is, like, schooling. She has one of her show collars. There's a gold, like, trim around it, but it's not, like, going to focus. She has her helmet. Um, she has... It's not... It's mixed together. She has Cowboys pink and black show halter. She has Romanza's bridle. Romanza's blue lead rope and halter for show. She has another morning gale. Um, two polos. And one jumping saddle pad in a baggie to keep it protected and just a zebra figure. So that's like what's in her tack like box. And I got these like tack boxes or trunks, whatever you like want to call them. I got them at like AC More Hardware and 
they like were only a dollar so it's pretty cheap for like a fake tack trunk and it sort of looks like a real one so yeah let me just set the phone down one second shut this up and yeah they were pretty cheap for tack trunks and yeah so the next one is annabelle's and it just opens up and she has daisies Bridal, I was going to say show bridal, her show halter that matches, a big curry comb thing that she likes to keep in there, I guess, and her jumping saddle pad in a baggie. So this like, trunk is a lot smaller, if you can't tell, but she is younger, so she doesn't have as much stuff in it as her sister does. So, yeah, that's why hers is smaller. And the next one is just a rounded one on the top. It has four polos and four shipping boots all mixed in together. And four harder polos for jumping. And then in, it says Dixie, but it's like daisies, basically. She has two polos on the tray, two bell boots. And then the tray comes out. There's an apple and jolly ball and then a bucket of treats. And then that is like a sheet or cooler down there. I don't really feel like taking it out just because, you know, yeah. And this came with a horse that said that was like named Dixie. I got this at like Target a while ago and I decided to just use it. And yeah, those polos I made on myself. So you can't really like get them in stores. So in there, there is two combs, like, cart pulling stuff and lunging stuff and a teddy bear and two trophies. Three more trophies, just some vet stuff. And in that gold bin, there's three helmets. I don't feel like taking them out because I'm feeling lazy. Right there, there's two vet things, a bag of bedding, the dog's food. The dog and people are in a big pile right there. There is scissors and a stopwatch in there, grain. Um, a grain bag, pulses, supplements, extra grain in the black thing. Um, and then a thing that Delilah had because she was injured on her leg. And then dog toys. And then, like, I think this is pretty convenient. I use loom things. I just don't tie them or, like, clip them, C-clip them as lead ropes. And they work really nice. You just clip them to the halter. And then, my like, the last thing on the top level is the cross ties I just took two like fence things I put loom rubber bands on that you just clip on the thing there is grooming box and bathing stuff and then two um, spots blankets and then down here there is the field that I said I just used a piece of wood for I put a fence around it there's like a jump a little container thing there's apples two hay bales like a ball that they play with and a water trough Right there is my two horse trailer, um, the truck, and this clip, like, if you're taking the blankets out or off the horses when it's, like, warm out, you just clip them all together, and you can just put them in the back of the truck if you need to take them anywhere, and, yeah, here's the, like, barns trailer, it's, like, a truck and a trailer together, this just opens, and in there, there's some extra water buckets, there's two saddle racks, and then bridle rack stairs to put, like, saddle pads up here, and then the horses area. And then I'm going to show you one more thing just to, like, show you that I do have actual bridle barns. There's the house that the people are in. There's the barn, and there's another barn, and that's a ton of briar stuff and stuff that I made. And that was my old, old tack room. Or not old, old. It was pretty old um and yeah thanks for watching comment rate subscribe and i hope you enjoy this i know it's nothing much but it's just a briar barn tour bye